Oh, he is something else. A man who has exploded on the scene. Intercontinental champion, the ultimate warrior. Hulk Hogan, at WrestleMania 6, I bring you the one and only Ultimate Challenge. Ultimate Warrior, me and my Hulkamaniacs put the championship on the line. The main event in WrestleMania 6, the Ultimate Warrior squaring off against Hulk Hogan. Oh, hi. wait a minute. They're going to go at it. There's not going to be any WrestleMania. They're going to go at it right now. When I said that WrestleMania 6 was more intense than all five WrestleManias put together, I meant it, brothers. You are about to enter a world close to parts unknown. WrestleMania 6, the most important day for the rest of our life. Do you, Hulk Hogan, look for a place to hide, or do you face that challenge? What's it gonna do when the largest arms in the world run wild on you? You will know, Hulk Hogan, who is the Chosen. What's up once again everybody, this is Tim13 with Tim13 Gaming here at WrestleMania 6 and I included that WrestleMania, that um, video package because I wanted you people to see just how insane Ultimate Warrior really is and I will be including something at the end of the video also that might show you just how insane he is. So this is WrestleMania 6, The Ultimate Warrior vs. Hulk Hogan. Um, I don't need to say anything else. So, let's get into this. This is the main event of WrestleMania 6. It is scheduled for one fall, and it is title for title. Introducing first, weighing 275 pounds, he is the... Chugga, 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 woo, woo! The ultimate warrior. <laughs> See, now, I kind of can't help the feeling that, like, 2K has never really seen a wrestling ring. You just, you gotta watch the way Ultimate Warrior shakes the ropes. Watch this, watch this shit. Oh, wait, no more. <laughs> Alright. Come on, come on, shake the ropes, man. Here we go. Watch this shit. Yeah, ropes aren't really like that. The the ring ropes are like ropes. In WCW, they were elevator cable wrapped in like some kind of laminate, you know? Or electrical tape, something like that. They're not like giant fucking rubber bands. I don't know. Some people have that perception, but they're not. And I've run the ropes before, and it kind of hurts. It sucks, so... Takes a lot of work. Title for title. This is what it's all about. This is what has brought 67,000 strong to WrestleMania 6, and they are ready. Both men are in tremendous physical condition, JR. You notice how Hogan took his time coming to the ring? The Warriors already sweating more. Oh, that's a sign, JR. Alright, I will be taking control of the Ultimate Warrior, who is the current Intercontinental Champion. And I don't want to talk about it. Alright, alright, come on, hurry up. And there it is. That's what we're here for. I don't think they uh, wanted to show it, but this was the site of Ultimate Warrior's infamous plane crash promo. Basically talking about uh, being on a plane full of Hulkamaniacs, kicking in the doors of the uh, cockpit, and then sending the controls into a nosedive. Except he screamed it. And then said, Hulk. It's as if they want to cheer for both men, but can't. One way or the other, all right. 
Tonight we make WWE history for the first time. And wait, wait until you see the conclusion of this match. It's just as fucking retarded as the match itself. <laughs> and my brother loves to refer to the the blowjob test of strength. <laughs> see what it is is like, um. At WrestleMania 6, Hogan and Ultimate Warrior did a test of strength. And Ultimate Warrior wanted it to look like he was losing the test of strength. So he kind of dropped down to one knee and started shaking his head back and forth wildly to, uh, you know, to make it look like he was really struggling. The camera angle ruined it, though. And it really looked like... Hogan was just getting the most fucking ferocious blowjob from the Ultimate Warrior that you've ever seen. And I've seen a lot of them. Oh! The carnage. The impact. Just oh. oh shit. I tried to pin him. They didn't even give me the chance. Ha ha! German. Jeez, that was kind of fucking brutal for, for 1990. Ow, fucker. Yeah, I can't really say shit like that much longer, because, you know, we're, we're getting up to current times when stuff like that happened regularly. And also, you'll notice the, the grainy screen effect. That is only true of the earlier WrestleManias, and when we get a little bit more current, um, that effect will be gone. By the way... If, I doubt it. If anybody from 2K Games happens to be watching uh, these videos, props on the fucking the grainy video effect. I'm actually, I really dig that shit. Thank you for that. I don't remember what my first objective is. Irish Whip Hogan light in the ring. Well, he's at light damage, so time to go for a ride. Oh shit. I didn't really Irish Whip Hogan, did I? Oh god, no. Warrior should have just stolen the match. Put your leg over Hogan's shoulder. <laughs> do it. Do it. There we go. Oh, God. <laughs> he is losing his friggin' mind. Oh God, I'm coming down. Yes. An interesting side note is that we are coming up on um on the first 30 years of WrestleMania match that I have not played yet. I stopped playing at oh I believe WrestleMania 9 when I realized that I wanted to start doing these videos. Um and I believe from no I'm sorry I I remember playing the ladder match between Sean and Razor. But I believe from that point forward, I have not played any of those matches. Again, because I knew that I wanted to make these videos. And I kind of wanted everything to start being a surprise to me instead of just like, you know, well, here we go, I'm playing this match again. So we're more than halfway there. Alright. Fucking dropped him right on his dick. Throw him outside the ring. Throw him outside the ring. Aw, oh, you're no fun. Alright, here we go. What the fuck? You no-selling motherfucker. Yeah. How's your fucking ball bag feeling? Oh, shit, I missed. Well, that was embarrassing. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. And what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Oh! Oh! Damn it! 
No, I don't want to. Hi, you missed. Well, that was the actual ending of the match that they just fucking ruined, so that's kind of cool. <laughs> the sad thing is, I'm not kidding. You will, you will see very shortly. Hogan misses a leg drop. Ultimate Warrior gets up and does the fucking stupid splash to Hogan's back. And that's the match. Truly not kidding. Ha! Ah, caught your leg. Oh! Wow, I am not a fan of Hogan's dick in this match. Yeah! Oh, shit. Well, I didn't know that was going to happen. <laughs> Me not know that Hogan was going to no-sell? Hidden objectives. I hate these fucking hidden objectives, because I could just go on and on with this match not knowing what the fuck they want me to do. Okay. No hidden objectives. Hidden objectives, WrestleMania moments, I'm not a fan of any of that shit. Whoa, what the fucking lag was that? Yeah, oh shit. Oh! Get off of me. Take that. Yeah. I'm going to punch your face some more. Punch it, punch it, punch it, punch, 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 punch. God damn it. All oh, this fucking taunts take so long. And I'm starting to believe it. <laughs> you kind of deserve that, Warrior. Oh, God, Jesus. Here we go. You missed. Yeah, it's happening again. Okay, let's turn this motherfucker over. What? The fuck? I thought his finisher was the fucking stupid splash. Oh god, whatever. Okay. What the fuck? It's not a fucking. It's not a ground move at his head. It's not a ground move at his side. Boy, I wish I could get help from fucking all two people in my audience. I'm at a loss. I don't know what to do here. Oh, God! Holy shit! No! Ugh. It's a good thing the game keeps fucking lagging like that. I wouldn't have gotten that any other way. God damn it, Hogan. Ow! No leg drop. No leg drop. Don't do it. Ow, fuck. You have to kick me in the head on my way to standing up. Whoa. What are you doing? You're not really going to try to pin me off. Oh, fuck. No, but he's going to try to pin me off that, and he's probably going to get it. Yep. Oh, God, that was fucking terrible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hogan didn't win at WrestleMania 6. Spoiler alert. Oh, fuck. They just showed the hidden objective right in front of me, and I fucking skipped right over them. I'm gonna make some quick work of this motherfucker. Yeah! JR. Oh God! Holy shit! That was awfully negligent, Warrior. Oh shit! I missed. Hi, you missed too. Ah, oh, fucking hell! I give up with taunting for Ultimate Warrior. It just is a bad idea. 
is by the time he finishes the taunt, your your fucking opponent's already punched you in the mouth. Ow, ow, ow. I don't know about the middle of next week. I mean, that's kind of far away. I never really got the thing about knocking people into the future. You get them so hard that they think they're in the past. But never that they think they're in the future. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna skip this. We all we saw it. Oh shit. Motherfucker, man. I wasn't ready. And there's a reversal. I want to figure out how to fucking kick him in the face again, because he definitely deserves that. Damn it! I was lifting up my leg, too. It's the most work Ultimate Warrior has ever done in a match. That'll give you a big old goose egg. And did you hear the impact on that kick? Oh! Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. I'm going to kick you in the face. God damn it. Down he goes. Motherfucker. Yeah. I ain't working these punches. I'm actually punching this motherfucker in the head now. Because he's making me mad. Get up. Oh, I missed. Yeah, that's right. Oh, fucking hell. I hate you so much, Hogan. Got him! What do I have to do? Complete the first WrestleMania moment. Uh oh. I'll be out here if you need me. Whee! Ah, shit. Ooh. Cheering for both men are deafening with their support. I shouldn't have painted this stupid fucking target on my chest. Oh god! I really hate it every time he does that. Alright. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, fuck it, good enough. Yeah! And yes, I'm serious. That's the Ultimate Warrior's finisher. Look at this. I actually finished the fucking taunt from Ultimate Warrior. You killed the referee! Oh, actually, fuck this. Time to go. It might be a good idea to just stay down after that. This guy's just getting worn out. I like how there's a chair next to Hogan. There's a huge fucking dent in the form of somebody's head on it, and Hogan is fucking dead on the floor, and the referee couldn't put two and two together. <laughs> Uh, if he didn't kick out, I was going to break that shit anyway. Ow. Fuck. Come on. Defense. Ow. Fuck me. Ow. God damn it. And the video continues. Wow, once again, Hogan did not win at fucking WrestleMania. Rematch. Oh god, this motherfucker is more annoying than Undertaker in fucking defeat the streak mode. And that shit sucks. Oh, that's pretty good. Fuck you. That was a fucking weird suplex. Oh. I don't 
don't know how that turned out. You're not really supposed to do that anymore. Not to mention, it's really fucking bad booking to have the, the world title or the world champion and intercontinental champion be the same person. One of those titles will go undefended in any given night. Alright. Hogan's at light damage. Time for the Irish whip. Yeah, 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 we saw. God damn it. I'm gonna kick you in the face again for that. Get up, you fucking vegetable. Ow, shit. Oh, god, no. Fuck you. Yeah, suck it. Here we go. Ready? Road kick. Oh, for fuck's sake. Fucking computer players in this game play like they're a fucking human player online. It's constantly with those fucking running grapples and shit. Oh, come on! Ow. Fuck you. Yeah, oh shit, I missed. Yeah, your face is on the floor now. That is bad. Oh! Fuck me. God damn it. Well, apparently I'm on a comeback now. Here we go. Oh. oh, you motherfucker. I'm gonna fucking smash you with another chair as soon as we knock the referee out. Oh. Fuck it, I'm gonna go for a pin. <laughs> I don't know why you did the count in super slow motion, ref, but... Uh-oh. Oh. Yeah, no super slow motion for me. Yeah! Here we go! Going right outside. Follow me, quick! I'm gonna be the ultimate heel. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look at the emotion. All right, hurry up, hurry up, finish the taunt. He's gonna come kill you. Finish the taunt. <laughs> We're good. All right. Uh oh. Oh shit. Ow. Get your fucking hand off my face. It smells like cocaine. How the hell did I get a finisher? Ow. Fuck. It fucking skipped right over my signature, which is what I need to do. Get off of me. Fuck. God damn it. Ow. Wow. Oh, fuck. I hate you so much, Hogan. Yeah. Shit. Fuck me. Go to hell. Hurry up. Do the splash. Do the thing. There we go. Yeah. Ah, oh, here we go. I just got my signature. That's what I need. Get up! Get up, motherfucker! Sell! Wrestling! 
One, two. Ah, oh, shit. Just what I need. He's hulking up. Great. What's he saying? Punch him in the head. Yeah! Kick him in the fucking nose. Nobody's going to stand up from that shit. Come on. Ooh. Oh, fuck me. Where's he going? Nigga, you let him fucking turn... You turn your back to him? Pay attention. You! Oh, whatever's happening, I don't want to do it. Here we go. And seen that one before. See? See? I fucking told you that was the actual finish to the match. Holy shit, that was annoying. Now, obviously they cut it out of the game because the company didn't want you to see it, but there you go. Okay, no, there it is. Hogan took it upon himself to go outside and get the world title and hand it to the Ultimate Warrior, celebrate with him a little bit, and then fucking mope his entire way out of the arena. And basically the camera stayed on him, completely absorbed the fucking moment for Ultimate Warrior, but whatever. That match was... Look at those fucking wacky ropes. That match was... More energetic than the actual match. Yeah, no, I can't even say that it was a terrible match. It was actually pretty good in this game. The match itself fucking sucked, but... You know, what are you gonna do? You're working with the Ultimate Warrior, right? Alright, well, that was... Oh, who am I gonna... Who am I kidding? I was gonna say that was fun. That was fucking terrible. And that shit took forever, and I'm sorry. Oh. Uh, whatever, it was kind of fun. Alright, well, once again, thank you for tuning in. And I will see you at WrestleMania 7, where Hulk Hogan will fight Sergeant Slaughter. And I'll actually have a funny story for you about that, so be sure to tune in next time. Thanks for tuning in this time, and take care, everybody. Vince agreed to let me go do things outside of wrestling. And uh, I had the chance to spend some time with him. He invited me to come to his place, mm -hmm. and they're all there. Vince is there, and Pat Patterson, I don't know who else was there. And Vince said they've got ulterior motives, and uh, then he went and got Jerry Briscoe. We went in the shower, and he proceeded to have Jerry Briscoe from the backside. He was a real hard worker. Just a grunty style, like he was grunt. So I was interested to get involved. And uh, I told him what I wanted to do, you know, have people put around me that could direct me effectively so I could go on and be successful at it and stuff. There were plenty of guys there, and it just grew. So we both let one another F it, F it, F it. And they were congratulating me, saying, man, that was awesome. This is really great. And... Uh, Late that night, Linda came into the picture, and I said, this is unnatural, you know. I've just never been into any of that stuff. You know, women and, you know, all that stuff and everything. That doesn't work for me. I almost fell to my knees and just started throwing up right there. And then uh, something told me to come. And he said, don't come. You don't need to come. And uh, I said, what do you mean don't come? It's what I wanted to do. And I didn't push it in their face. And he said, okay. It was unbelievable. It was a shoot. And I had incredible discipline, and uh, it was magic. Next morning, about 11.45, Vince eventually stepped in. He couldn't even walk right. He stepped in and said, I'm not doing this anymore. We're not doing this stuff. And uh, I was really surprised that he did that. Like he just wanted to keep going from one thing to the next. 
as long as somebody would stick it out. I mean, he had an addiction problem, and, uh, you know, I would have expected more.